Hello everyone, welcome to our Pecha Cucha presentation. We are Ivani Macias and Eliana Fernandez and we are going to talk about France as a business country. Our first topic is going to be demographic and geographical aspects of France. Known as the Republic of France, it is a beautiful country located northwest of Europe, surrounded by the Atlantic Ocean, the Mediterranean Sea, the Alps and the Pyrenees. France has provided Europe with one of the greatest cultural, social, economic, gastronomic and linguistic contributions. To speak about his geographical limitations, France on its mainland is limited by an ocean, three seas and eight countries. Limit to the north with the North Sea, in the west with the Atlantic Ocean and Cantabrian Sea, in the east with Belgium, Luxembourg, Germany, Switzerland and Italy, and in the south with Spain, Andorra, Monaco and the Mediterranean Sea. To greetings and farewellness in France, it is very important to learn how to classify your greetings and when to use them. Their greetings and farewells as for informal situations, as for formal situations. The most common ways to greet someone in French are salut in the informal way and bonjour in the formal way. On the other hand, physical contact is very common. So kisses on the cheek are accepted, but only if there is trust and it's not a formal relationship of work. And finally, how to say goodbye. First, we have au revoir in the formal way and salut in the informal way. The gender differences are quite noticeable in the French. Every word has a gender and they are very specific with this topic. This applies for the rest of the French life in general. The articles of the world will always determine the gender of it and it's important to pay attention to this. The article LA is feminine and the article LE is masculine. It's always important to pay attention. Another thing that you should know is that when a word ends in E, it's feminine gender, and when it ends in another vowel, it's male gender. But, of course, there are exceptions. And beautiful example to this is that in English, the apple does not have gender, but in French, the apple is la pomme and it's feminine. The hierarchy in French society is very important and it's culturally very marked and that obviously it's added to the labor hierarchy. It is necessary to always maintain a respect and formal level when dealing with elder people, studies, jobs and related. On the other hand, in terms of business, the French are very committed and correct people. It is important to have present that the French business protocol requires total formality during negotiations. Always, always remember to maintain politely and calm during negotiations with French people. Punctuality is very important for French people because it is part of the commitment. For the French, it is always important to arrive at least 10 minutes before scheduled and it's absolutely unacceptable to cancel a commitment of any kind at the last moment. On the other hand, as in any other European country, the dress will always vary from time of the year. However, the French have very good taste when it comes to dressing. Business wear for the French tend to be on the formal and conservative side. For women, that means no overly sexy office wear, and for men, it means traditional business suit. Launches are a strategy that serves to incur and the light business contact. Brassfuss and other events are little used. Launches usually compose of strands. It is a main dish and dessert. Then there is a coffee and the wine is something that will be served frequently. Wait for the host to say bon appetit to start eating. Your hand should be visible in your elbow of the table. In case of finish the meal, you must put the knife and fork cross up on the plate in the form of a pyramid for a pause and pile it in the center of the plate when finished. Don't forget to leave a deal. It is recommended to leave 10%. You shouldn't sit at the table until you are invited to do so. During business meal, it is possible not to talk about business. Those topics are usually discussed during coffee. It is important to eat and drink slowly, and you shouldn't serve the wine. It is better to wait to something to serve you. Try not to use English. It is better to speak in French. 
People should be called by their last name and then use Monsieur, Madame, or Mademoiselle. When you are introduced to a person, you must use a phrase such as Je suis très honoré. The French use courtesy gesture like hand greens are to this should be given without much pressure because it can be disrespectful if you are introduced to a woman wait for her to fur your hair home. It is very common to make eye contact and exchange information cards, whether academic or professional. There are two issues that are important not to touch because they are considered as lack of education and will cause discomfort. You should not talk about money or talk about the private life of any person. It is also important not to establish close ties because it is a lack of respect for the privacy. You must use good manners. Business appointment must be requested at least do it in advance. Send detailed information about the company or products. Show you no letter of the subject and show that you research enough. The negotiation shouldn't be quiet. It is important not to talk about personal issues or touch confidential topics such as scale, salary, or amount of business. Don't use humor in very serious situations. It is important to do detailed long-term planning. The logic must be used. There must be a margin between business life and private life. And it is important to propose options that benefit both parties. It is important to avoid moments of tension. It is preferable to support the opposite position. The price should not be negotiated fears. It is important to leave him for the end. It is recommended to discuss any discrepancy before any meeting.